So the first thing we have to do is navigate to the Irena Flex Tool website and when you're there you, you just go to download Irena Flex Tool. You click that, put in your first name, last name, email address um, and then your organisation name and you should be able to put in the organisation type, academic, governmental or another one from the list. Select your country and then submit. Then you'll get an email sent to this email address, which I've already got here. Click download the data workbook and that will automatically download the Arena Flex tool uh, zip file. So that's now downloaded. Um, so you have to navigate to the place where it's downloaded, such as downloads, and then you copy that and put it in a location of your choice. So I'm going to put mine in documents, but you can obviously put that somewhere else if you want. Right click on Irene Flex tool and you should be able to do extract all and you place where you want to extract that. I'm just going to extract it here. Once that's done, this is the folder that contains flex tool and yeah. And the main um, file for flex tool will be this one here, which is the micro flex tool Excel file. So if you click open on that, it might take some time to load because it's quite, it's quite a big file. Okay, and there are instructions in here which tell you exactly what you have to do, but we're just going to run through that now just so we have two sources of reference. So the first thing we want to do is enable editing. Then we want to be able to enable content. And then once that's done, so it's just loading now, we click on file options at the bottom, trust center, trust center settings, um, and then macro settings. And then we click on trust access to the VBA project object model. I've already clicked that, but yours won't be clicked if you've not done this before. Click OK. OK again, and that should be done. Then to actually um, run the model, you just click on run scenarios. And that will open the command line. Let's just give it a few seconds. And this is now running. This is running two scenarios. Um, and it will take some time just to do the calculations. So we'll let that finish. And in the background, you'll see that there is actually the results are being output from these these scenarios. So it should automatically open the results file. And here are all the results for the rest of the that you'll be using the rest of the, of the rest of the course to see the results of Flex Tool. And that's that's everything to get you started with um, with Flex Tool. Um, Thank you.